Now, if, if we were to say uh, the three most important aspects of any online business, regardless of what it is you're selling, uh, as long as you're selling a product, not a service, you know, uh, the three largest assets, the three most important things will be search engine optimization, pictures, and product descriptions, or r any anything you put into words. These three will be the most important things. Um, so search and engine optimization plays a major role. And the reason for that is because, again, when when somebody's looking for something, they have two things that they're going to find you through pictures and words. If without without the words, nobody's going to find you without the good picture. Nobody's going to finally click and purchase from you. And if you don't describe it well, uh, and you know descriptions also participate you know they're, they're also the same thing as search engine optimization it's not just titles but search engine optimization is very important if i'm selling a black t-shirt and nowhere in my title in my description you know there's there's a word black t-shirt how is somebody looking for a black t-shirt is going to find it oh, now the when search we, engine knows to show yeah, yeah, exactly. You have to, you, and, and you have to understand something. When you're dealing with search engine optimization, you're really dealing with two different things. Number one thing you're dealing with is the software, meaning Google software, Etsy search engine, eBay search engine, and all of these engines work a little bit differently. The other thing you're dealing with is the buyers. You know, what are they exactly? Like? So if I ha if I have a product, the number thing I always think about is how would somebody looking exactly for this and i mean exactly for this how would that person search for it well when we if we're talking about things that have a upc number like a apple iphone uh it's it's easy you know not not much even though even there search engine optimization helps a lot but it's not required that much however if i'm selling jewelry for example you know uh, there's different ways that people call different things for example eternity bands the the ones where the diamonds go all the way around i know a lot of buyers a lot of people mistakenly call it infinity bands so so if you're a jeweler and you're selling etern diamond eternity bands you know you need to you need to include infinity bands you know you need to inc include that word infinity otherwise many many people who search it that way will never ever ever see the light of your item and they will never potentially end up buying it. Why? Because they couldn't possibly find you. I see a lot of products online. Yeah. They they have titles. They don't have descriptions. And I, I, I think that's bad because, because every single word matters when it comes to search engine optimization.